Hello, ladies, gents, and thousand-year-old elves with nothing better to do. We return to my favorite place in the world. It is the desolation of the ravenous in Rimworld. I've queued a whole bunch of new orders. I realized that we ran out of freaking storage space. That's why nothing is being hauled down here. And a few smelting options so we can free some of this silly, silly weapon hoarding that has been happening is so freaking idiotic completely worthless to me what the hell am i going to use these weapons for they're not even good for selling they're just trash so they're getting smelted fat head nerd is just feeling a little sad who cares about fat hair nerd not me we have that quest pending right here and of course of course we're going to take them in. The question is, <laughs> what will happen to them? Whoa, it's, it's just exciting to think of all the possibilities. For now, these good souls are going to be accepted. I already have queued up a few more beds. Make sure that, uh, you know, they get accommodations. Let's take a look. Are they pig people? No, just one of them is pig. A pig man. Zug. All right, let's... Pause! I want to see what you idiots are capable of. In fact, I'm going to, you know, take a take a good look at them. I, I can I can just go in regular speed. Okay, this guy is, is uh, hot garbage. This guy is hmm, hot garbage. <laughs> Actually, you know, he's an intellectual. If we can get him to... Oh, here's maybe my possible shooting specialist. He's already useless at most things. And then there's Zug. No, top, top cop must top cop. Who you pronounce that? To cop must or to chop must? To chop must. Probably to chop must, right? What an awful, awful name. Your parents absolutely hated you, and <laughs> it reflects on your abilities. Pyromania, sickly, with absolute trash abilities. <laughs> what a! Uh, he's a teacher. <laughs> he's a teacher. Sounds like a regular 2024 20, high school teacher. Am I am I right, fellas? TikTok infested. Uh, we got a wimp, <laughs> pigskin, worthless heap of dirt, Metoshis. It's a genie, so you can't expect much. But he, you know, like every genie, he's going to be good at crafting, good at intellectual. He's a great medic. And he is not... What you call it? Uh, unwaveringly loyal. So we can actually have him be a member of the colony and be our super researcher forever. And then there's Sam, which is the only person that is worth a damn. Even a recluse. Huh? The few people that say in Sam's faction, the happier she is. Better alone is <laughs> being alone is best of all. Incapable of caring, firefighting, and plant work, which is fine. Careful shooter. I mean, cooking is nice. But this would be an excellent candidate for being our shooting specialist. For now, I'm going to assign them tasks. They can do some work and we'll see what happens to them. I just glanced to the side and saw that I never unpaused the recording. <laughs> this is, oh, this is so painful. This is so painful. That was like 30 minutes. 30 minutes of grand old times. Repelling this damn siege. Oh, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. Poop and Zug. This, the name of this person. Does it tell me the previous name of this thing? Chop Chop Tomos. <laughs> I got sick of it, so I'll rename her Poop. These two are completely worthless. Sam is the one that is not worthless, and she's the one that is now hiding in the room. Oh, I can't even remember when I stopped, when I paused the damn recording. It's it's so awful. Oh, <laughs> it's, it's so upsetting. Anyway, mostly you missed managing the colony. That's about it. It was just managing until the until the siege came in we repelled it quite nicely and i decided that poop is going to just die excuse me metoches i know that he's your buddy just let him die let 
Zug, expire. We don't give a crap. Oh, uh, this piece of trash. <laughs> Just go research. I resolved to get these refugees, let them work for a while they are useful, and then Sam. Sam is a very good shooter and hardly anything else. Excellent candidate for a shooting specialist. Metoches, I'm just going to let him uh, let him research for a while and then we'll just, I don't know, chop off his head and eat it. Probably, and then uh, we'll just uh, have to deal with all this silly nonsense. I so, oh, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. Anyway, I'm confiscating these mortars, bringing them back to the colony. I just got done saying that Mortars, I'm really, I don't really value them that much because it's, um, they just sit there. You use them so seldom, even during attacks. It is seldom that you actually use them. You would rather just go out and meet them or use certain defenses, not have to hang back with some of your colonists to make that defense happen with the mortars. It's uh, filthy. They ate a grenade from bog or pork and they both went down zog and poop but you see look at their look at their stats they're absolute trash garbage they're just awful so i literally send them as frontliners to intercept people coming in that did exactly their job poop one of the desperate refugees who has to stay with you has died the others are not willing to accept this have decided to leave I'm going to have something to say about that. I'm going to have something to say about that. Fellas, do they, do they just vanish? No, no. They don't just vanish. Here's Metoches. You can leave. You're worthless. Where's Sam? Because Sam, you're going to have to stick around. <laughs> he just uh, convinced you to stick around. <sighs> this is going to become for... for um, Prisoners, just coincidentally, let's bring over. Unfortunately, I don't get to even arrest her. I didn't realize that somebody just dying. We'll do that. Now I'm going to have to punch and pray. It's unfortunate. That's what's going to have to happen. It's going to come this way, go up that way. So let's uh, set up. Go over here. Oh, Blargo, you're way too far. Just do what you want. No, we don't care about this piece of trash. Mm. Maybe if I... Let's see. Let's see. Let's test it. Capture? Try to arrest. I can still arrest them because they're not hostile. Oh, nice. So we just need... I guess hike, right? Hike would be our absolute best. How are you doing? You just got cut with a knife. Just get off your ass and go do your job. Arrest Sam. With your trusty club. We will upgrade it to uranium very, very soon. Don't worry about it. Oh, I'm so mad. I'm so mad I lost like 25, 30 minutes of, of game. There you go. <laughs> Back to the prisoner cell with you. Your mistake was coming in here in the first place. And now there's just no way out. You're just going to have to join us, whether you want it or not. And you will join us. Recruit. There you are. Definitely a... Please. Unforbid. I want to haul it. No empty space. That's what I was trying to do. I think... I, I don't know if I mentioned it or not. While I was recording... Made a whole bunch of new shelves, made sure to, you know, have some space. Got all this junk all over the damn place. Please, I just want to select the stockpile. There you go. We're going to ex expand it to all these areas. And that should allow me to be able to hold this. Yeah, hold the charge lands. There you are. All right. Sam shall be recruited eventually. As will Tater and Kaisel. More idiots to fill up my ranks. Alright, finally this guy's dead. 
<laughs> he was so worthless. Even in death, he was annoying. Hey, microelectronics have been researched. Let's get some drug production going. Oh, that's that's excellent. Miscellaneous comes console. Let's see, where do we want it? I usually put it somewhere central. It doesn't quite matter though. I guess it can go here in the production area. Uh, it's so fat though. I guess we can put it with all the all the mech stuff. It doesn't quite matter. Over here, hmm? corner. Is there a better spot for this? Maybe in the middle of the hallway or something? It's so bulky. Mm, we'll just put it here in the corner. Just here. I don't know if it's one of those things that you can move. That's why I'm, I'm so finicky with it. Because so many of the buildings, you're not allowed to move them. And it's just obnoxious to build a new one. Will complete make mace. Excellent. Let's put like this. Who is it? Just Kaisel and Tater, huh? I guess you'll just have to get punched. Um. Oh, where are you doing? Okay, it's, it's nearby. Ragman. Banana. Very helpful. T Rose is cooking. Let's cook a knuckle sandwich. Hike is just moving blood. Brexel, where are you up to? Yeah, everybody, everybody coming here. This is a, a fine troop to get people punched. These absolute idiots. They just open, right? Yeah, when there's a prison break, they just open the door. It's like they figure out how to open the door and that's how they break out. Anyway, how's the, where's the mace? A good uranium mace, nice. That'll be Hike's new weapon. All right, everybody. Let's get to punching. Don't kill him. Oh, come on. Go in there. One down. And here comes Tater. Just go down, Tater. Stop swinging. All right. Well done. Idiots. They just got punched to oblivion. All right, good stuff. Somebody <laughs> made their stomach bleed. Uh, before I forget, Hike can equip this uranium mace. I've been recording for 30 minutes already. I'm like, oh man, my voice feels like I, I could use a break, but it's only 12 freaking minutes. Oh, I'm so annoyed. <laughs> so annoyed to have... Oh, lost that time. But it's my own fault for pausing and not realizing that I never unpaused. I just started talking again like a moron. <clears throat> they deserve to just lay there for a while. That's what they deserve. Fine, capture them. Go out there, rack man. Just put them back in bed. Just another beating will speed up the recruitment process. They'll uh, understand. Hey, we got a control pack for Blargo. Equip the control pack. How about you? Oh, I'm like, why is this not being repaired? This is not in the home area. All these uh, materials, all this good stuff should be in the home area. Still make sure that they get repaired. What? Animal deceased. We don't care about that. Uh, animals are super good about recovering from illnesses. We don't have to worry about it. Medical treatment? Just after birth and the gut worms. All right. Ah, good old rim world. Loving it. Loving every bit of it. Oh man, my batteries are running out. It's not. It's probably, uh, it's time to toggle power on this. I didn't realize that they were so close to running out. Ragman, flick that off. They just suck up so much juice. It's too freaking much. Could use some extra wind turbines. Could use all kinds of, of more stuff. We got all this giant space over here. I don't know exactly why I left this giant space. Probably just to have an extra room of some sort. 
I guess we can... Uh, yeah, it can just be like this, right? We'll put it like so. And then another one like this. And we need to run power. A wire. Wink, wink, wink. And between them two. What I should do, structure, slate. I should have, in the case of the shootout, I should have a wall running this way. That protects this stuff from being shot at if their shots come in this way. I think it's a, a fine measure to take. I have failed terribly. I'm so annoyed. <laughs> Just get over it. Just get over it. It's fine. You get to see the aftermath. You get to deal with the nonsense. I wonder what kind of prisoner. 13. That's nothing. Sat wonder of fat head nerd. What a weakling. Absolutely pathetic. We could punch him. Just let him be. Let's just let him be. I am just getting tired of all the violence. What's going on here? There's something going on here. This is full power. I think a conduit got broken. That's what's going on here. Power. Look at that. How did that happen? What? <laughs> My power. My power grid got disconnected. When? How? Why? I'm, I'm looking at it like, how? Obviously, it's something I did. But how did it happen? It wasn't put in the mortar there. I don't know. It put some redundancy there. I have no clue. How did the power grid get interrupted like this? No freaking idea. Blargo. Get done with that nonsense. Get these power conduits built. That is so ridiculous. I have no idea when that happened. I'm sure if I went back in all the footage and all that stuff, I will be able to find it, but... Uh, we're, you're, you're meditating. You're meditating. Get the freaking power conduit built! Are you some kind of buffoon? There. Holy crap, brother. That was stupid. <laughs> all this time. All this time. The batteries have been powering the, the entire grid all by themselves. It must have been when I put down the mortar. It must have, right? I have no idea, but... Where else was the the power? No, no, I don't know. I don't know. But it got, it got cut off at some point. I think maybe even hours ago. It's possible. All right, Tater and Kaisel need to be inducted into the damn colony. It needs to happen. Really want to have that shooting specialist. You know, the refugees, even though the quest was quote unquote failed, was it really a failure? Was it really? It was not. What? Stream break race on Afterbirth. What is this problem? Oh, but he got Cathars. This is fine. It'll be fine. Is Hike ready to convert again? No, I used it on Afterbirth while I was not recording. And uh, we can reconnect this. Hmm. It's just one conversion attempt away from being converted. All right, I do want some drug production. Ooh, a new quest happening. I want this comms console built. Why is Blargo doing anything other than... Other than building it. Build this comms console right now. Quest! You've learned of an ancient complex nearby that's said to contain ancient treasure. You can break in to collect the loot inside. Be warned, these kinds of structures can contain a variety of threats. I love me some ancient contract constructions rating. Let's cap off the episode. I mean, I would be have done it by now. The siege would have been the central part of the episode. Now, I'm doing a freaking caravan to get this place taken care of. Blargo, I feel he needs to stick around to, to build things i've been neglecting all these buildings i need more i think it's gonna be probably like break soul the thing about break soul is that 
he's wielding this damn charge lance. It's such a bad assault weapon, you know? Uh, but I think Banana is absolutely going. Crack like Bagway is an excellent guy to send. It is my researcher, but it's fine. And to cap it off, I mean, Blargo is a great guy to send, but he's building. He's building things. Hmm. Ah, there'll be someone else to build. As soon as this thing is constructed. Get the comms console built! There you go. Oh, baby, I can now summon the mech. I'm not going to do it this episode, but I will. World. Form the caravan. Go over here. Accept. Let me set it up. I hit the button to resume. I did. I decided to send Effin Damas Banana and Crack Like Back Bay. I don't want Blargo to send to uh, risk his life needlessly. Feel silly. Who knows what terrible, terrible things we might encounter there. Sometimes it's trivial, but sometimes I've had some ancient complexes that are a nightmare. That all of these damn insects and there, there's an infestation that comes after you. It's like, holy crap, I should have brought four more people to this damn thing. And you know, you barely escape by the skin of your teeth. So it matters quite a bit to uh, not risk something that you really cannot do without. Will I be heartbroken if Banana F and Damas and Crackle back with that? Yes. Bruh. <laughs> Why you do this to me? Freaking Cassandra! How can you do this to me? I just sent out Banana F and Damas and Crackle Black 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 Bay. Let's see. Let's take a look at this mechanoid cluster. That doesn't look bad. That's really not bad at all. This is the only real problem. Let's see. Proximity activator. I don't like that because it's so close to the crops. Let me see that message again, please. Didn't even read it. Mm, landing nearby. It may remain dormant until disturbed or it may have a timer. So let's take a close attention. We got a proximity activator. Somebody will get close and activate it. Countdown activator in four days. And I don't see anything else. Then we got two garbage militors, which are no problem whatsoever. And then the turrets are much more of a, of a problem. But we do have some smoke pop. We do have some smoke pop. Uh, backpacks, at least one of them. Fire foam. It may have been left. No. Fathead Nerd has a fucking freak, freaking fire foam pack. No fire foam, but smoke pack. Oh, it's just a fire foam. So I think you guys have it. One of them may have it. We'll wait until they're back and then we'll mount an assault. But these guys could actually handle it pretty handily. It's not bad. Do I have a smoke pop freaking uh, belt anywhere? Or a backpack? I could have sworn I did. This is such a nightmare of a <laughs> storage area. Uh, maybe I can build it. Do I have the technology? Mm, no, I think you need to research that. Probably somewhere around. Yeah, smoke pop packs. They are deceptively great. Like, you don't think much of them when you look at it. Like, eh, what the hell do I want this thing for? They're awesome because they prevent ter uh, automatic turrets from locking on. They provide all this cover that is just a huge boon to be able to take care of mechanoids. I will still count mechanoids as the number one threat in RimWorld. It is... Uh, they can... I have survived so many things. I think number one reason why a colony may go beyond salvaging is mechanoid clusters. They are so rough. So rough. There's a counter activator. I didn't realize they was there. They can be so rough. Some are trivial. Some others are just a nightmare. So let's get that place explored. Have them come back and then we'll do... The cluster, they should have plenty of time to get it done. Oh, 
Oh yeah. All right. Before that happens, let's make sure that there's work all lined up here. There's plenty to be constructed. Make sure that all the things are happening as they're, they should. The prisoners are being lowered in resistance. I would like you to prioritize freaking Sam. Like She's the most valuable here. But either way. Okay, it's fine. Feeling confident that I can just leave and let things happen. Actually, no. Let me queue up some more hauling. Only all this garbage. Hold it. We are even smelting all those uh, for extra metal. Get that hold as well. Get that slag. All this lag. Hold. All right, that should be plenty of work while we pay attention to, to this place. All right. Very square. All right. Only one entrance. We, uh, that, I've never let that stop me from going wherever I want. There's a smoke pack. All right. I thought that I had one. I was, I was very confident that I had one. So suddenly we have like three different things to take care of. We have, of course, this ancient complex. We have that cluster. And then we have the Diabolos summon that we got to do. Didn't even pay attention to how, how these people are. Crack like Vacuity. Yeah, they are. Please, I want to. I want to select. I want to. <laughs> select banana. All right, they're all like, almost completely full. Break your way into this complex. We'll see what we can find. But area revealed. We have just one mechanoid. That's it. Go in there. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's attacking right away, huh? Release the animals! Oof. Shit. We can treat that real quick. Let's see. S -s -s furniture, sleeping spot, medical, crack like vacuum. Rest until healed. F in damas. Actually, you can treat... That's not necessary anymore. You can treat people. What do you mean without medicine? Uh, gear. You can treat people. It used to be you had to put them on a bed. Not anymore. Okay, ten. Not without medicine, though. Orders. Allow. There you go. Where's the medicine, though? I think because it's not on a stockpile. There you are. Now, can you... Ooh, tend with medicine, though. Health. Yeah, it's there. We have herbal medicine right there. Evan Damas. Maybe because he's still drafted. He's tending. He's going to go grab it. All right. It's quite the bleeder. We want to be... We want to patch people up. Let's look what's in the next room. One of these, huh? We don't want to go in there. Let's go down here. What you got? Just another military. You can fall back. All right, that's treated. All right, let's go down there. Waste pack infestation. Picked up the center recently. They sold toxic waste pack. They're tunneling upwards to get close to the chemicals. Wonder if this is scripted or it's just so happened that there's toxic toxicity here and they are emerging right now well that's upsetting but cyber trunk and murder thrust will take care of that okay this uh, attack pow, 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 pow. oh come on crack like back v. there you are Let's see what happens. Wonder if they'll attack the doors, they'll they'll have access to the doors or what? Would be nice to just set off the the fuel cell. Take care of this problem. Ancient terminal. Comms console. Hermetic crate, but I see a freaking fuel node. 
a lot of bodies. This was probably a mass suicide cult. Okay, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna go right outside. Okay, so... Trigger dormant. So uh, it's nothing that we care about. Everybody outside. Banana's gonna go in there real quick. Oh, baby. And that happens, all right. <laughs> they didn't expect it to be triggered until I open the... Until I open the container. But that also works. Go boom! Get wrecked. You filthy mega scarabs. Cyber Trunk has uh, caught the flu. All right, well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> what do you want me to do about it? There's nothing I can do about it. Okay, they, they got barely hurt. And now they're just attacking the scenery. Uh, please? Murder. Except crack like back, but you don't need to charge. All right, it's down. Attack, attack, attack. Attack the wall. It's very important to have access to the outside when there's one of these cells. Are we gonna trigger? Yep! Son of a bitch. Okay, everybody. Just get the hell out of there. Kaboom! Don't shoot through the animals, though. Damn, that was huge! <laughs> that was a massive explosion! Please. Bring down the scarab. There you go. All right. Well, everything's on fire. Not, not my brightest moment, but it is what it is. There's nothing I can do about it. Um, I would like to attack this, please, because I would like to have access to the security crate. Thankfully, it doesn't seem to burn very fast. We can open this up, and they will be out for. Uh, the temperature will not be burning. It's a thousand degrees in there. Instantly 17 degrees. So what we gotta do is just wait this out. The fire will die out and we'll be able to go in there and climb the spo clean the spoils. Um, I might be able to just send in there... Send banana in there. Let's see if I can use the... The sup oh, Well, never mind. <laughs> It might catch fire. This is a bad idea. Go away, go away. It's not hot in here, is it? No. It's outdoors. Alright, this seems safe-ish. Hack it! Sure. What's the worst that can happen? Psh! I'm not worried. Get out of there, get out of there. There's a mech hive arriving nearby. It's just a Militor. Do you think I'm going to give a crap? You can get in there without burning, right? Ooh! <laughs> More silver! How exciting! His fur is going to catch fire, and I'm going to have a real bad time. But where's the supplies? Jeebus, look at the freaking fire! It's out of control! Well, this was a massive waste of time so far. There appears to be something amazing in this crate once the fire dies down. Where's the military? Right there, the red dot. I guess let's go out to meet it. It's not like we have anything else to worry about. Countdown on 3.8 days. Oh, come on. It's gonna shoot, it's gonna wound me, and I'm going to be pissed. How can you miss every single one of these shots? There you go. It's all good. <laughs> I'm going to reform the caravan. Not going to do it just yet. I want to open this damn crate. Let the fire die down. I want it. I'm going to break with some clack clack back. He's just that. No, I'm in the greatest of times. It's just a rough area with zero benefit to benefit to... Uh, to visit so far. It's just been a miserable experience. Open this damn sandstone dumbass thing. Open the security crate. 
Okay, a jump pack is amazing. <laughs> everything, everything was worth it. Let me get out of here. What a pain. Reform that caravan, go out there, accept. All right, I want all the components, of course. We want the jump pack. We'll load the militaries, they are shreddable. That's it, that's all, that's all we want. And then grab the, that herbal medicine them back to the area and then we'll let them get back in here manage to kick the butt of these damn mechanoids hopefully <laughs> maybe a problem but they shouldn't like there's always the chance that a stray slug from the the turrets is going to absolutely destroy me this is a problem but you know you go around the corner you pop a smoke right here and you shoot the crap out of it it should be okay Bruh. Really? Really? How are you not treated? Like, I literally treated you. Right away. How can you be infected? I've been damaged. Took care of you. This is just not right. Anyway, we're dude. We're good. Everything is properly taken care of. It's all underway. Gonna be an active episode. We may lose somebody. It is a very real possibility. And uh, if it all goes well, kill that handily. We will summon Diabolos at the end of it. Because, you know, when an event like this just happened, Cassandra is not gonna send something else right away, is she? No, of course not. She would not do that to me. How's the progress on these idiots? Prisoner. 11.3. Oh, wow. Tater is about to be recruited. And so is Kaisel. They shall be inducted into the Cult of Blarg with new names. I'll probably do that. Like the moment they get converted, we're going to do a conversion ritual. Hike is uh, almost off cooldown. It's going to be great. And then they shall be reborn with new names. A new sense of being. In the Cult of the Blargonites.